Now let's talk about entering our budget into QuickBooks and using QuickBooks to track our actual against our budget. To begin, we first need to set up our budget in QuickBooks. Come here under the Company pull-down menu and come down to Set up Budgets. Here, we can set up budgets for the entire year and individual months. Let's demonstrate this by pulling in legal fees. Let's come down here to professional fees, legal fees. Here, let's budget our legal fees at $1,000 per month. Next, select fill down and click OK. And now we have $1,000 a month in each month. If we need to increase this amount by a percentage, simply come here and we can increase it each month by, for example, 5%. Click OK and you can see how QuickBooks recalculates the amounts. We can also override. So for example, if we know that we're going to have some legal expenses in March that are higher than normal, we can enter that here. We can also do the opposite. We can also fill it in as a negative. If our legal expenses are going to increase 25% next year, enter it as, I'm sorry, decrease, enter it as a negative. And you can see how our budget decreases throughout the year. Now, let's click OK and let's go look at a financial report on our budget. Let's come down under budget, budget, profit and loss budget overview. This report shows our budget how we have it set up now. Let's change it to this fiscal year and let's collapse the columns. We can see that we've budgeted $27.5 per month for income, cost of sales and expenses, etc. Now let's compare this budget with how we're doing. Let's close this, come under reports, budget, and profit loss budget versus actual. Let's collapse the report again and now we can see that here's our actual 45,000 and our budget 27,000. We're over budget in income. That's always good news. Here are expenses and here's our ordinary income. We have a loss of 6645 versus a budget. So we have a $15,000 shortfall here. We're going to need to analyze this further and see why we're not meeting our budget. That's how to enter and utilize your budget in QuickBooks.